last time I mentioned how mental health and emotional well-being forms one of the building blocks for balance. So what do we mean by mental and emotional well-being? Well, everyone has mental and emotional health and well-being, no matter what age you are or what else is going on in your lives. And throughout our lives, this can move up and down a continuum, ranging from good mental health and well-being to poor mental health and well-being. Even people who have a mental health condition can move up and down this continuum, just as those who don't have a condition can move from good to poor mental health. When we have good mental health, we might find we have much more enjoyment in life and find it easier to deal with daily stresses. We might be more motivated to do the things that we want to do and generally enjoy spending time with our family and friends. However, if we notice that our mental health or our emotional well-being is moving down the dial, life may feel more of a struggle. We might lack energy or drive to do the things we need to do or want to do. And we might find ourselves withdrawing away from other people and spending less time with them. We might start to think or feel in more negative ways. Everyone can feel like this once in a while. However, if you notice that you or somebody close to you is feeling or thinking this way for long periods of time, or that you might be struggling or in crisis, Please remember, there are lots of things that can be done to help you. Most importantly, please talk to somebody you trust. This could be a family member, a friend, a teacher, a counsellor, your doctor. There's someone there to help you. And there's numbers attached to this email that you can contact. But remember, we can all do things to help our mental health and emotional well-being. And keep watching these videos for more ideas. Thank you.